Hello everyone. In this demonstration we have a problem with our DWS 3160. It seems that we've logged out and now when we log back in our password does not work. So we've lost our administrative password for the DWS 3160. If we don't have a backdoor or if we have not created an additional way to log in as an administrator, we will need to reset our password. And that's what we're going to demonstrate now. So I have to cancel this. So what we'll need to do is use our favorite serial console server. In my case, I'm using TerraTerm. Now I need to set this up to log on via the serial port. So I'm using COM11, 115.200 is the baud rate, and the data and the one stop bit. I'm going to click OK. And I'm logging on from the command line just to show you that right now I do not have access. So admin, admin, trying the normal passwords that I use and I am completely logged out. So what's our recourse? What we'll have to do is reboot the switch, set it back to factory. How do we do that? We'll reboot and we'll hit the shift and six button. Shift six. So let's do that now. During reboot, we'll see the power on self test and during this process we want to hit and hold down the shift key simultaneously hit six the number six and the message we're hoping to receive is the password recovery prompt so we have that now and what we simply need to do we want to reset our system so we could see the available commands we have by hitting the question mark and enter and what we want to do is we want to reset and we hit the tab key and we can see our options so we want to actually reset our config and then it will ask us if we're sure we want to reset the configuration and we say yes the reason we say yes is because we know we have a backup of our complete config from a previous demonstration. So I'm going to reboot at this point. And we'll reboot the switch. Now once the switch is rebooted, we'll be set back to factory defaults. And once we're back to factory defaults, we'll restore the original config or our production config from our config file we saved earlier. So our switch has completed rebooting. So let's try to log in now. So we'll need to log in to the, 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 the default factory default IP address 10.90.90.90. We could use the, the default login and password. All right, everything's set to factory defaults. So we want to restore our config at this point. So to restore our config, we need to go to Tools, and we want to download our configuration. Now, we'll pick HTTP. Now, keep in mind, we're restoring a previous configuration where we know the password. If we do not know the password of the previous configuration, then we'll need to reset the password following pretty much the same procedure we just demonstrated. So let's browse for our files and restore our configuration. And we know the password for this configuration. So we'll click Browse. And here's our config file. Click Open. And we'll click Download. So the download configuration will be applied. So let's just give it a few moments while it resets the configuration and then we'll navigate to 
the IP address of our production config. So let's go to the IP address of our restore config and let's log in with the known password and username. And our configuration is restored. Thank you for networking with D-Link. For more helpful videos, please check out support.dlink.com.